This is probably going to be the most difficult speech that I'm going to give as a member of this parliament. I ran to be an MEP to fight for more rights for citizens in the European Union and now millions of European citizens are going to lose rights and there is absolutely no way for me to, to talk this positive in any way. But I would like to end and we are approaching the Brexit date, I would like to end with two positive messages and the first one is that all EU citizens in the UK have to be absolutely sure about the fact that there are dozens and hundreds of MEPs working here in this parliament to keep this your parliament as well. We will work tirelessly to defend your rights here in this parliament. And the second one, and this goes out to all the people in the UK who are heartbroken right now, and I know that even with this movement that is unique in European history, it has not been possible to put this decision back to the people. But these demonstrations and all the signs and all the tweets and all your votes, they were not in vain. You built something absolutely beautiful over the past years. And this is the largest pro-European citizens movement that we have seen. And we will build on that. And trust me, one day I will see British MEPs being re-elected to this chamber. Thank you very much. Thank you. One minute, Mr. Fidanza.